All right, Cape Disappointment and Long Beach, Washington are popular summertime destinations for Portlanders. Yeah, but on today's Andy's Adventures, Andy visits during the spring and wonders whether the weather will stop him from having a good time. Here we are in Long Beach, Washington, where they claim it's the world's longest beach. So we're going to go check it out. People normally come here in the summertime, beautiful. We came in the spring where the weather can be a little bit iffy. But guess what? With the blue skies right there, Andy's adventures, blessings come through once again. So let's hop on our bikes and go explore Long Beach, Washington. The Discovery Trail. I'm discovering I'm glad I have an electric assist bike going against the wind. <laughs> I see this sign right here that says Aunt Lena's Fudge. I had an Aunt Lena, and she was about 102 when I was three years old, so uh, I don't think it's the same one. But let's try it. I would like some of that dark chocolate caramel sea salt. Anna Lena, or Aunt Lena to me. Give this a try. Have a very good. It's a bit breezy today. Winds are picking up, so what a great place for a world kite museum. The only one in North America. What brought you here to this fine community? The beach. The beach. Hoping the weather would be nice. And look. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> it's, I think we're in that five minute window. Yes. yes. <laughs> are you tall enough to ride the go-karts here? They're tall enough to ride. These two can't drive. Yeah. You can't drive? But he hasn't taught you how to drive yet? Looks like the weather's gonna get lousy. Let's trade in our bikes because we can drive our car right on the beach. Nothing like going for a stroll on the beach on a windy day inside a climate controlled car. I'm sure tow trucks are readily available out here. First time I've ever had to drive and try to avoid hitting sandcastles. This is pretty cool. Uh-huh. What a sunny, beautiful day it is. <laughs> it is. <laughs> does it feel good? Just the, the beard just blowing in the wind right there? Feels natural. Oh my god, this is a big oh, 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 oh my god! Oh, oh, oh. Take a picture! Take a picture! Quick! Oh, 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 Bring the camera! Oh my god! 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 Oh my <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> They're from Florida. It was so fantastic. So we just, so we've cute. been giggling about that I mean, all this morning. is what we do. That was like Kim and I every morning when Andy yes. comes by, oh, by yeah. the makeup room. Exactly. We just freak out. Exactly. So it was this very point is where that took place. It was we Aww. were walking back from the lighthouse, and this is where the uh, young ladies came in. And what's funny is, you know, we talked about seeing the jetties and the mouth of the Columbia. This is the first time we noticed it. One, because there was a little distraction going on as we were walking back this direction. <laughs> and two, the wind was coming so strong and the rain was coming in, we couldn't even look that way. But let me show you the lighthouse, which is just right over here. They're doing a little bit of a remodel uh, on it right now, but it's a, a working lighthouse. You see the uh, the lighthouse light go around, zip around every once in a while. And uh, yeah, it's just uh, another gorgeous part of our uh, beautiful Pacific Northwest right here along the coastline in uh, of the Pacific Ocean. 